Us versus use. But versus boot. Are you pronouncing these U sounds correctly? Get ready to learn exactly how to pronounce them and when to use them. The long U sound is very much like the Spanish U sound, but in some words, like in U and use, you'll hear that we put a Y sound in front of it. U, use. In the phonetic spelling, you'll see this as a U with a J. The J indicates the Y sound, U. It is common to use the long U sound in words that end with E. For example, use, huge, rude, tune. We also use it in words that end with UE. For example, do, true, blue, glue. It's also common in words with two O's. For example, two. Food, soon, room. The phonetic symbol of the short U sound looks like an arrow pointing up, and that's how I remember it, because it is the same sound in the word up, up. It sounds very much like the schwa, but it isn't as short and it is pronounced more clearly. We often use this sound in words that do not end in E, where the U is in between consonants. For example, but, run, sun, bus, shut, under, study, lunch. We also often use it in words with O-M or O-on. For example, sun one, from, some, money, month. Be careful not to pronounce this U sound like the Spanish A. Ah. Listen to me say these words with the Spanish A ah and then the English A uh, so that you can hear the difference. Bot, but, bot, but, op. Up, op, up, bog, bug, bog, bug. These words do not exist in English with the Spanish A sound. Now, let's practice these two U sounds. First, say these words, then listen to me say them, and then repeat them with me imitating my pronunciation. But, boot, but, boot. Ton, tune, ton, tune. Sun, soon, sun soon run rune run rune cut cute cut cute now go to the link in the description and record yourself saying these phrases then save your recording and copy the link into the comments here. We will listen to them and give you feedback. If you've followed this pronunciation series up till now, you'll, you now know the main vowel sounds in English that will help you pronounce and communicate better. But there are more sounds, and that's what we'll begin explaining in the next videos. So make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss them. And if you found this video useful, like it and tell us in the comments what you think about the U sounds. See you in the next video.